be spitting these bars. You don't want to come at me while I'm going to Mars. I'm spitting rhymes for days. Everybody is in a haze. You don't know me like that. You might even think that I'm fat. Oh! Man, I'm just trying to spit some rhymes out here. I just, I get home and all I want to do is make a video on Lord's Mobile. Just go. Man, please, please let me stay. Please, just leave. Man. What is going on, everybody? Man, woo! Let's go. It has been a while. I say it's been a while because, guys, those of y'all who did not watch my vlog video and who doesn't support me and watch my videos... Mm. Um, I've been in Mississippi this past week for work, okay? And I haven't really been able to edit any videos or nothing like that. Uh, I pre-recorded videos and had them uploaded, which they, they wasn't as good edits. So, sorry about that. But, let's get into this video. In this video, we're going to be playing some Lords Mobile on the Android device. Now, this is going to be a iOS, kind of an iOS, um... Not update, but a uh, iOS uh, version hasn't been released yet, okay? So this is like a, um, a video to help y'all out and all you new players and all you other, you know, your lure mobile new players out there. Let's go. This is to help y'all out, hopefully, man. I hope it helps, it helps you out. I, I don't know. I don't know if my videos help out at all. I don't know. Who knows? Anyways, so let's get into this video. Before we get started, let's go ahead and shout some people out okay let's freaking scream let's scream some people's names first person we're shouting out is fluffy panda Woo! let's go shout out for me the fluffiest panda dude dude or girl you are the fluffiest panda you are the fluffiest freaking panda i know next person goes to aog baluga xd xd is more like a smiley face but he said give a shout out to mad dog hulk Mad Dog Hulk, what is going on, homie? How you doing out there, bro? You doing good? You, 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 ah. D88 Soju, Saju, yeah, right? Said, shout out for me, Soju from the Philippines. What's up from the United States of America? What's up, Philippines? And last shout out is going to go to Wolfie. He didn't ask for a shout out, but bro, I'm going to give you a shout out. What's up, Wolfie? How you doing, man? How you doing, bro? That's the homie, guys, Wolfie. Don't mess with, don't mess with Wolfie. Alright guys, I'm going to go ahead and move my camera where it's at right now because you you'll be able to see like all the tabs and stuff over here. But uh, first, let's go ahead and start with the guild tab, okay? This is like the guild tab right here. You click it. If you join a guild, you can have all this stuff. You can send help to your teammates if, they're, if they ask for help to level up their buildings quicker. And by doing that, you get uh, daily guild coins, okay? You can only get 20 at 20,000 or 20,000 a day. And um, whenever th with the guild coins... You can use uh, the guild coins to buy items and, you know, all, all kinds of different stuff. Resources, whatever it may be, right? Then you have, like, in the guild tab, you have, you can send supplies. You can send supplies to your members here. You can hit supply and then, you know, send whatever amount of food or stones, whatever it may be, and hit supply, and it'll send that to them, okay? Um, so that's that. Let's go. And then we have, uh, you can send reinforcements as well to your members, to a, a certain member of yours, whatever, re hit reinforce. And uh, it will send whatever amount of troops you want to that person, okay? So that helps out a lot to help them attack people. Or if someone's attacking them, you can um, uh, send them troops and whatnot. And it'll, it'll help defend their castle, okay? Then you, you have right here a rally battle, okay? So a rally battle is um, a guild can rally against you, okay? That meaning the guild will rally together. All their members will send all their troops to one player in their guild, and that one player will go and attack your guild with all their players, okay? That's what a rally is. If, you, if that happens, then it'll give you like 5 minutes, 10 minutes, 30 minutes, whatever it may be. They select how fast they want to get to your base, and you hit assist your rally, and you can send reinforcements to the person that they are rallying, and you'll be able to help them out that way, okay? Um, this, I'm not going to click this right here because it's going to show everything on in our uh our uh, non-public info in our guild but this tab right here is show it pretty much shows like your message board to your guild members and it shows it pretty much shows your guild homepage, like how many members in your guild who, who's in your guild 
who are your allies, your enemies, all kind, of, all that kind of good stuff, right? So that is that. Next, we're gonna go over here to. You have your messages right here, the little message tab. You can obviously send messages to other players. That's pretty much all that is. Next, you have like your uh, your quest, okay? So you have your turf quest, meaning your uh, when your buildings right here, right? Your buildings, like these are these are your buildings, lumber mill, your castle, whatever it may be over here. Whenever you upgrade that, you usually get. Whenever I upgrade my manor to level 17, right now it's level 16. Upgrade level 17, I'll get uh, I get all this stuff over here, right? Your XP, your might, your food, stone, wood, coins, all that, all, all that other stuff, right? So that's what that is, okay? So there's just a slight little quest you can do and to to get rewards. Next is the uh, like the option tab, I guess. It shows the rankings. You can search for members, uh, search for guilds, shows your account. You can change your language, all that good stuff, right? Uh, then you have your inventory, which you have, you know, your unique has like your X, your your XP, your XP. Uh, you can add to your heroes, which we'll talk about that later. Um, all, like all kinds of different stuff, like your like a little cabinet where that can uh, you keep all your stuff in, I guess you can say, right? So you have your resources here. You stack up on your resources, your speed ups, your combat, your chest, like all, all kinds of stuff, right? All kinds of stuff. Then you have your gems where you can buy gems. Or you can buy stuff with your guild coins, okay? So right now I have 208,000, and this is where the uh, helping your team, helping your guild out when you get guild coins. So this is what uh, this is all about, okay? So that's that. Let's go ahead and get really into it, really more in depth with it, okay? Let's talk about the uh, the hero stages. Let's talk about the hero stages. So the hero stages is golden statue right here, okay? Now I'm not, I haven't beat it yet. And I'm about to move my camera over again. All right, so right now I am on normal chapter seven. Okay, chapter seven, seven of six. So right here, this one is seven of three. Okay, so seven of three. Then the little square right here, this little square, seven of four. Next square, seven of five. Next boss is seven of six. So it jumps. The bosses jump from uh, like in in intervals of three. So seven of three, seven of six, seven of nine, so on and so forth. Uh, those are the normal stages. When you beat normal stages, you'll get, uh, I'll show you right here. So, well, I haven't beat this one yet. Let's go to, you have to three star. Again, you have to three star. If you want to do a sweeps, meaning if you want to just beat the stage without actually playing through it, uh, you have to three star. Okay, so for instance, this one, I've already three starred. So you can sweep it over here. When you sweep it, since this is a normal stage, um, I'm only going to get like, uh, I'm only gonna get these these two books right here, okay? I'm not gonna get three. Whenever you do elite stages and you and you sweep that way or you beat it, you'll get uh, three different types of books. You'll get one like 300 XP. Uh, there's one like what is it? Hold on, I can actually show y'all. There's 300 XP. Um, there's 60 XP, 300 and 1500 XP. Okay, usually uh, the 1500 comes from elite stages. Um, and the when you do normal, you'll do like you'll be like 60 XP, 60 XP and 300. Okay, um, so let's go ahead and let me go ahead and show y'all a a little. Um, let me go ahead and show y'all what a hero trial is. Okay, so obviously I'm at six. Okay, you start out at one. You start at one, so you gotta work your way all the way through until you get up to here. Okay, so this is a hero stage. So I'm not gonna sweep it. I'm just gonna go ahead and play it and show y'all what it's all about. Uh, these are your main, you have your heroes, these are the heroes I'm selecting, and right here, you're just, at, pretty much, I'm not, you don't have to do nothing, just let them fight, okay, but you have your little special meter bar here, the little yellow, whenever it fills up all the way, you just click that person, and they'll use their special ability here, okay, so you see, how the, see the enemy end up being, uh, they got stunned from his, from Demon Slayer, from his ability, okay, but every hero has a different ability, and top left, one of three, once you, you got to be able to, uh, you got to complete all three of them. So one of three, two of three, and three of three you have to complete. So now we got to go to the next one. And so remember their abilities. If you want to use this little lightning over here, use it. And it'll automatically use people's uh, ability without you even having to click. So you just it just does it by itself. You just watch. Sit back and watch. You know what I mean? That's all you got to do. But uh, I like to not use that, okay? Sometimes I do just in case. To get you know, so you can use your proc a little bit quicker, but I'm not. I'm gonna just use. Um, I'm gonna click by myself and see. Uh, I, I don't know. To me, I like that better. So, oh, Demon Slayer's about to die. All right, I gotta see. So 
Now I'm going to use a black crow, okay? So her proc, or whatever you want to call it, you can select where you want to uh, drop it at. Bring it over here. I need to get ready to heal. So this little pixie person over here, Prima Donna, she heals. Demon Slayer is going to go ahead and use his proc. I want to click it, obviously. And then I have the big guy, this big, big guy right here. He's swinging his freaking sword around. There's his little rock thing. Let's go. And we'll drop it on her. Spins around. There we go. Attack her. Oh, Demon Slayer's about to die. Oh my god, I don't know, he's probably gonna die, he's probably gonna die. He's he's dead. He's gonna die on me, don't die on me, Demon Slayer. Demon Slayer died, but we have four more, that is okay. Alright, there we go, she is now dead, and there we go, we completed that stage. Now guys, look, I'm only gonna get two stars on this, okay? Two stars up here. The reason why I only got two stars is because I didn't, uh, I didn't keep all of my heroes alive. You have to, you have to beat that stage with all three heroes, women with all five heroes being alive and not dying, okay? So, um, yeah, so pretty much the hero stages, guys, you'll get rewards. You'll get rewards for it, obviously, like you just seen. Uh, you can get any of this stuff, right? Uh, and these rewards are used to upgrade your heroes. So when I'm, what I mean by that is, let me go back and show y'all. Um, when you click this little hero card, no, actually, when you click this little, uh, yeah, it brings you to the next tab. This little skull helmet over here. You click that, and here are your heroes, okay? Here's the heroes. I'm still working on them. Uh, I need to get all these down here a little bit higher, but it's okay. But anyways, these are your heroes, and, uh, for instance, this is your, like, your, pretty much your, uh, your equipment that you can equip to your guy, your person, to make them stronger, okay? Um, so I have all of, you gotta collect all six of them to rank them up another rank okay so it starts at level one and then I can show y'all down here I don't know what level these guys are level three okay so um, in order to it says owned I have the equipment to use it on him but he needs to be level 24 right now he's level 22 okay so for instance black crow over here uh, she's high enough level so I click that and I need uh, six more of these little boots, little shards. These are called shards, okay? The little, when you see this little blue little square thing right here, those are shards. I need six more of those, so, um, it shows me where I get it from. I get it from, uh, the bunny here. I get it from the bunny, and I have to get these shards from her. Luckily, I three-starred her, uh, three-starred the bunny. You can see right here, the three crowns, and I can sweep it. So whenever I sweep, it does it by itself, and I like, okay, I got one shard here. And I got another one here, okay? So they're like random. They're randomly to get. Um, and I also got XP bo uh, books. I got 1,500 XP, 300 XP, and 60 XP, okay? That's from doing Elite. This is an Elite Dungeon, okay? Elite Dungeons gives you better rewards. Um, and the reason your stamina, it says to use six, okay? Stamina, the heart. That is up here, the heart, right here, your stamina. I have 420. I cannot do it again unless I use gems, okay? Which I'm not going to use gems. Or if you have a brave heart. Now, a lot of people get confused with this. A brave heart is, it says right here that I have nine of nine brave hearts. But they miss, is, you can misinterpret this very easily, guys, okay? Nine of nine brave heart. This does not mean you have nine of nine brave hearts. It means you can use nine of nine brave hearts, okay? So you go over here to your inventory, and you look at Brave Hearts right here, okay? Brave Hearts increases your stamina to 120. You can do that nine times a day, okay? That does not mean you have nine Brave Hearts. That means you can use your Brave Hearts nine times a day, which th those are really rare to get. Uh, like, honestly, they're really rare to get. You can get them from killing Frost Wings, uh, high level Frost Wings, whatever, you know, maybe at, uh, mining them out of rocks. I'm not really sure, but... They're really rare to get, or you can spend money to get those, okay? So, um, yes, that is that with the hero stages, okay? Um, everything else is pretty self-explanatory, guys. I mean, you have your, uh, your, your lumber, you have your coins over here, your stone, your, uh, your mineral, or not your minerals, your, uh, your resources, your, uh, not your resources. Why do I keep calling them resources? Your, your ore. What am I doing? You have your ore, your uh, your gold, your timber, your stones, and your food. Okay, uh, that's all over here. And you need all of that pretty much to build uh, to build your buildings over here. Okay. Now, so what else do we want to talk about? You have your army camp here. Okay. Also have your army camp. Start out at tier one. 
uh, to upgrade these to, to if you want to get to tier two you have to go over to your research over here your research and you go to military you, you obviously you start at the very beginning and you have to work your way down the tree work your way down the tree and here is tier two right here okay so obviously you start at tier one no matter what work your way down and you have to get to tier two once you unlock tier two it goes down then you can unlock tier three okay once you do that you go down and here is tier four you need level 25 academy 25 academy or 25 building level is the highest you can get guys okay so just this is for those who did not know that okay so it's um level 25 is the highest so that's how you get tier four it's gonna take a while um but and you know there's all kinds of other stuff upgrading your walls your traps your buildings all that other great stuff right so and then you have a prison over here you can capture leaders capture people's buildings you have to capture it says right here you can capture enemy leaders with level 10 plus a castle so your castle has to be level 10 plus and you have to attack another player's castle that has a, has a level 10 castle as well if you uh, if you 100% their base meaning they cannot have any heroes left or traps or nothing 100% their base you can capture their hero their leader and hold them in, in your prison for like two days and you can set a ransom on them they can pay you money all that good stuff now if you are level uh if you the if you attack someone with the level 17 or if you have a level 17 prison or a no wait scratch that if you have a let me see if it shows it right here yes it does the prison lets you capture enemy leaders with level 10 plus castle castle right like we were just talking about upgrade to level 17 to execute the leaders with level 17 castles so you have level 17 and you capture a, a, a leader of a level 17 castle you can you keep them in prison but after a certain amount of days you can execute them and you can wipe them out and kill them okay what so that is pretty crazy with that man um yeah guys that oh, you have hero skirmishes obviously you see my, my uh, I, I can go all the way out you know I can't go out any further any any further at all this is the furthest I can go you have hero skirmishes meaning this little area here was not unlocked you have to beat uh, you have to go in battle with the computer and beat them to unlock it and then you go over here do the same thing here do the same thing here so on and so forth the most skirmishes there are at the moment is skirmish 8 that's the highest skirmish okay guys that is going to do it for this video I hope this is very informative to y'all and it helped y'all out a lot I try to run through this as much as quick as possible to be honest with you to uh to give y'all an idea of how to play lords mobile if y'all are new or wanted some tips whatever it may be um but yeah i hope y'all enjoyed this video i hope y'all did if y'all did drop a like and subscribe and comment down below ask me questions because i respond and i read every freaking comment guys so comment freaking explode the comments down below freaking uh, explode hope y'all enjoyed the video i love y'all strive fan for life and never forget bro positivity attracts positivity thank y'all so much for watching Peace! Crap. Yeah, sorry. But I'm not gonna worry about them. This is pretty much for a start now to a person who just can't get shot.